All right guys, so in this video, we're gonna talk about the new firmware for the Pocket 4K 6.2.1. As you all know, I upgraded to the 6.2 a couple of weeks back, but unfortunately, the battery problem came back. Now, I asked a lot of people around in my YouTube and forums to see if, if they're having the same issues with a 6.2. As you all know, the original Pocket 4K was really bad at battery usage, and a 6.1 fixed that. So with the 6.1, I was able to get around an hour with the original Pocket 4K Canon LPE6 battery. With 6.2 update, even though we get that nice B-RAW, the battery usage went down again. So I was getting around 30 minutes to 45 minutes on Canon LPE6 batteries. And like I said, I asked a lot of people to see if they're getting the same thing. And most of them, they said, yeah, after updating the 6.2, the battery problem came back. 6.2.1 just came out a couple of days ago. Even though the patch notes doesn't say anything about uh, fixing the battery problem again, I did my own test to see if the problem was fixed once again. And I can safely say that with 6.2.1, I can get about 59 minutes to an hour using the original Pocket 4K Canon LP6 battery that came with the camera. Now I did two tests. I did one with recording via USB-C and one with recording via CFast 2.0 cards. For the USB-C, since a lot of people are also wondering about this, for the USB-C, I got about 59 minutes on the dot when recording via the USB-C, recording at B-Rock Q0. On the CFast 2.0 card, I recorded, same thing, B-Rock Q0. I got around an hour and five minutes, so the difference is not that much. And this is continuous uh, recording 24 frames per second. Uh, the difference is not that much, but you do get a little bit more when recording via CFast 2.0 cards because the USB-C uses a little bit more juice, apparently. So if you are having really crap battery situation with the Pocket 4K, before sending it back to RMA, go ahead and download the 6.2.1 in their website. Download that to see if, if your battery problem has been solved. If not, maybe even try different Canon batteries just to see if you can get more. But you should get around at least an hour per one battery if your battery is good. And that is what I'm getting now with the 6.2.1.